Hi, this is Ryan Blaisdell from Sloan Implement. Uh, today we're going to be talking about setting an adaptive curve line with a Gen 4 4600 display. So first you're going to go to Set Track on your Guidance page. And New Track in the bottom. Curve Track and then to Adaptive Curve. Uh, we'll need to name the line to come back to for future use if needed. Uh, next, we're going to uh, set our adaptive curve to record off of our number one SCV for our implement. So to do that, you're going to go Menu, Applications, Auto Track Guidance, Advanced Settings in the top, and then we're going to scroll down to the bottom um, until you see Adaptive Curves, and we are going to change the recording trigger to work state and we can back out of that and so now when you click down on SCV1 our recording is going to turn on so as you are driving uh, you will following that fence row uh, you will see that that line is being generated uh, behind the tractor so as you get to the end uh, of the field, uh, where you're going to turn around and make your second headland pass, you'll lift up on the implement. And as you get turned around, you will see that second line will generate and you can auto track uh, on that same pass. Now if you were to have an obstacle in front of you and you needed to uh, steer around it, you can just manually steer the wheel and it'll remake that line. Uh, you just have to remember when you come around to steer back straight. Any questions on adaptive curve auto track line, contact your local Sloan Implement dealer.